I'm Cédric Boisin. I joined Doctolib three years ago as the Chief Information and Security Officer for Doctolib Group. I'm Paul Marty. I joined Doctolib a year ago and I'm working on the security of Doctolib product. Doctolib is a French funded company that started in 2013. Whose mission are uh, one, to ease access to care for every patient. And the second mission is to ease practitioners' life in providing them with uh, ND solution in order to ensure that they can focus in delivering care to patients. We started our bug bounty program five years ago with Yes We Act, first on a very limited scope on a patient side. Then we expanded it to the pro side in order to stress the application that we sell to practitioners. Then we introduce as well our IT landscape to finally make the patient program public and raise the bounty associated to those programs. Since then, we did two major updates to our program. First, we've raised the maximum bounty to 25,000 euros. Second, we have updated our bug bounty program. High rewards require a very detailed program which aims to cover all the cases. To address this, we continuously improve based on the feedback from the participants and from the Yes React team. The bug bounty at Dr. Lee is a collaborative effort. The Yes React triage team will first qualify the report and then a security specialist from our team will take the ownership of the entire bug bounty process. He will be discussing with the security researcher as well as the team in charge of the feature. First, I would say that it's really important to start with a very limited scope, well identified, into which you can act very easily in fixing the vulnerabilities that are shared by Hunter and also limited the financial impact of providing rewards to hunters. Then, as soon as you gain confidence on that program, that's really easy for you to expand it to more and more applications. And the final point would be to actually wrote a very well-defined vulnerability disclosure policy in order to state clearly to hunters what is expected from them and what is not. Efficiency, it's a very good way to uncover security vulnerabilities. And when you think about it, the high reward is still a good price for a critical bug. Transparency, it reflects our willingness to deliver our product with the highest standard of security. Yes, we act, act as a partner that helps us to qualify the report, help us to improve our program, and sometimes they help us to define the high reward we give to security researchers. We have some exciting news about our bug bounty program. We have added three special scenarios where participants can earn the maximum bounty. First, we have the game over scenario if a security researcher can access to an environment variable. Second, we have the one shot scenario if the hunter can access to a large data set of patient health information. And third, we have the Casper scenario if the security researcher can exploit a critical bug without being detected by the security team. All our production and senses have a secret button that any security researcher can push at any time to demonstrate that they successfully hacked Dr. Lee. You can read more about this panic button in our public program.